Right, Taurus, this is going to be your reading for the end of September. It's going to be um, any card, so we'll see what it's at. It's for your sun, moon, or rising. So I'll shuffle a few times. Thank you for your likes, shares, and subscriptions as well. Do one more look again. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising. Let's see what jumps out. Justice. Okay. So you could be dealing with a Libra. It doesn't have to be a Libra. Every justice is coming in. Something could be going in the court system. Someone could have blood on their knife. Number 11 could be relevant. Yeah. And it's over some indifference in love. Somehow, Taurus. Yeah, some indifference in love. A complete ending. Of a love situation. Maybe there was a choice between two lovers. It looks like someone chose them. And there's a Leo in that picture as well. Or there's a lion in that picture, not a Leo. Gemini could be relevant as well. Oh. Yeah, and it's got to do with somebody's choices, and in those choices, is you know, there's all sorts of things. But somebody made choices, and it was to do with love. So somebody, and that's going the justice system, and there's blood on someone's life for some reason, <laughs> whatever that is. Come on, what else do we need to know? Here? Yeah, it's called a complete ending in this cycle, like there's going to be a complete ending, it's the last card in tarot. Somebody may now want to be coming in with an apology, <laughs> on a very long stick, Taurus, yeah. Yeah, it could even be a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio, or somebody who's very controlled in their emotions. Like he has, yeah, oh, okay. So there could have been... A uh, Cancer Pisces or Scorpio or a Gemini Libra Aquarius as well. And they're coming up as men there, but it could have been women, it could have been men. Yeah. And it's left somebody very, very single. I feel like somebody wants to, whoever did whatever they did, is wanting to come in with an apology now. And then we've got some in reverse, right? Yeah, ten of pentacles in reverse. So somebody with a lot of money as well could have been involved in this. Maybe the money situation has been affected now. They've come out of some uncertainty because it's in reverse on some recognition and reward maybe they thought they were going to get. And that was in this situation where there was some juggling going on. Yeah, and I've got a feeling it was to do with some stability that was meant to be had. And then we'll do a new one line down there. But whatever the sneaky behaviour was is over now because it's in reverse. <laughs> Maybe somebody got caught, yeah. Yeah, temptations. These temptations, these sneaky behaviour, whatever is going on is over now, it's done. Or they're going to come back in and try and tempt you to go back with them. We'll find out more when they come down the road. Yeah, you could have been like, this could have been somebody you were very, very, like, attached to as well. So it could have been someone from your past, somebody from your childhood, somebody you had around. Yeah, somebody you also could have had a lot of patience with as well, Taurus. 
somebody hasn't left the situation that yet though so either you haven't left the situation or that person hasn't left the situation and they're not speaking any truth they're not sending any messages of truth just yet they kind of got in their chariot they've they've kind of got in the car they're just not going anywhere they keep putting the brakes on yeah they're looking at their ships coming in they may be waiting for you it could have something to do with yeah somebody could have shut the door they left the keys there though as i was seeing that card yeah and you know secrets on this person as well Taurus. you know what they were doing you know you see so maybe you haven't said anything but you know you see yeah they could have been being very generous and that caused heartbreak you need to heal from this situation and you need to also send them a message of truth on how you feel and what you know and what you see yeah you could be getting a lot of fiery, passionate messages as well. And you could have had a, like a higher level of commitment. I feel like somebody could have been doing something quite dark on like a soulmate relationship where it's caused like a break in a family situation. Yeah, and that's the truth. There could even be a pregnancy around. It doesn't have to be. Somebody could be bossing up. Whoever this empress is, though, is wearing a mask at the moment. So maybe you're, you could be the empress because you can be the empress, Taurus. But the, the, somebody's wearing a mask. Yeah, June could be relevant and A could be relevant. And this person was using um, a very high level of sex magic to lots of people, yeah. Someone's coming back from your past. Learn your family culture. Before you make a big mistake, look at this relationship. Good news for a joint venture. Finish what you started. It's important to complete it and listen to your true feelings. Don't let others talk you out of stuff. And any resistance to change could throw up difficulties. Don't cling to the past. Let go. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, there was an indifference in love. You need to drop these burdens. Burn these burdens. Drop, you know. She's dropping all the bits of paper. Maybe you need to write these things down. What this person did to you and burn them. <laughs> yeah, this person watched you drown and in these emotions as well. Watched you in this hangman. So this person, even if they don't say that they know, they know you know. Even if they don't say that they, yeah, they may want to talk to you. Somebody in your family may even want to talk to you. Yeah, there you are, Virgo, towards Capricorn. Yeah, you could have been working on something quite artistic as well. You definitely could have, you could have even been working on yourself. You could have totally changed your skin up. You could actually, like, be feeling like sending, yeah, Page of Water. That's sending a message. Paige just said messages, but she's like not in the war. She's out of the war. You're out of your emotions too. This other person, they're out of their emotions too, yeah. You're, you're wanting to go off and have a new beginning. And I feel like in your life, you're bringing down a facade at the front. Yeah, you're going to go off and go and shine your light. <laughs> Maybe you're going to send a message to somebody about stability. And it could be a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Yeah. Someone you were very guarded, someone who was very guarded with you, very guarded with money, or you were very guarded with. They could be coming in with apology after being blindfolded to a truth. You may have had lots of fiery messages with this person as well. Um, maybe somebody saw you as a star, or you saw somebody as a star, but somebody walked away. Somebody walked away from some money as well, or they were about to go, up, go and do one with some money, yeah. That could be a Gemini, yeah. The Wheel of Fortune is turning on that though. Someone got locked in that Wheel of Fortune, but there's a veil being brought down on, on these illusions and these lies. A the veil's being brought down in a village because there's a village behind her. Like there's a whole village, there's a whole lot of stuff going on in the background. And there's a veil being brought down on it. Slowly, slowly the mist is clearing and it's being, being going to be being able to be seen. Someone was too worried about what everybody else would think of them. Yeah. Your com your commitment is being tested and it's a time for healing chariot so you could be going somewhere somebody could be coming towards you don't react when this person comes towards you it could be a high priestess yeah you need to keep your guard up as well you could eat yeah you because of these illusions and lies somebody may come in with like a wanting a, um a new beginning with love that could be a war sign i see two of them there Either that's with you or that's with somebody else, Taurus, yeah. Somebody <coughs> somebody could be up of a night time, like, stressing. I see that, though. Some, you're being spoken to. You need to listen to your intuition because your spirit's talking to you. Yeah, you may get a, a message from a snotty fire sign as well. Could even be a Leo. Um, something you've been in your head about. Yeah, definitely a Leo. There's been a light shine on the situation, so it's been illuminated. Somebody lit their fire and there's been a transformation in the situation. And that's left somebody dancing above the clouds. And that, that person 
whoever that is, their intuition wasn't talking to them, it was below them, they were above it. Like they were dancing above the clouds basically, not listening to things, yeah. Trying to juggle too many things and it could have involved an Aries. Yeah, you're going to get a, a, like a message from a soulmate. Something you thought was a blessing or someone who thought you was a blessing. Somebody could be even be coming in with an engagement. Yeah, that could be even an Aries. You need to listen to your intuition, they told us at this time, most definitely. Maybe somebody wanted you to take a bite from, from an apple that wasn't too great. Maybe someone would put something in that apple, I don't know. Anyway, we'll begin. Right, what should we use? Um, let's start with these tools. Right, your first line is um, justice, this, blood on the knife, which is going to end all these cycles. Yeah, and it could have something to do with some money that's in reverse, so, yeah. And that could be somebody single on their own who's got a lot of money, but they haven't got any money anymore because it's in reverse, yeah. And somebody's gone wrong, yeah. There could have been, like, an argument, a fight about this. Somebody could have been really quite immature, sticking their tongue out, thinking that they were, you know, invincible, maybe, yeah. That could have been a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio. Someone's looking at their cup of love now, and then he is there. Yeah, that person could have been a player, could have got jabbed in the head as well. And there's going to be judgment on that situation, because it could even be a child being born on that situation. Someone's blowing the trumpet on that. Judgment's blowing the trumpet on that. Your hard work has paid off to us. Your finances are going to improve. I see that somewhere else. Yeah, transportation could be getting a car. Temperance, Sagittarius could be relevant. Why is this Ten of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, because someone's going to burn down a situation and then they're going to leave it. Because somebody was seen leaving a situation. Somebody was watched while they were sneaking away, trying to leave somebody out in the cold. That could have something to do with that Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, they wanted somebody to fall out of the window on all them swords. And that had something to do with the moon. Could even be you, Taurus. You could be in the high priestess priestess mode, or you could have been done to a high priestess. Somebody had to protect themselves from demons. Maybe even five people all attacking them. It's the end of this show now, because there was a show going on. People were watching in a situation, but there's the end of that now. That's 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 done. Yeah, and that's this is the end of this heartbreak. And I feel like why that's the end of them ten of pentacles. Yeah, and the, and then. There's, a, there's definitely a child somewhere around this situation from a one night stand energy there's a child being born if it's not born it's about to be born yeah and that's going to bring down a town two people are going to get blown out and they're going to be shown that one of them's already hit the floor it looks like a black man and a white man or a black man yeah whatever someone needs to keep their guard up and it's definitely it's got something to do with a threesome and a fish could have been one woman a black man and a white man yeah Somebody tried to run off and have a new beginning after, maybe, but they've got a lot of fish swimming around their feet, yeah. Somebody could have even, like, stashed some money. They could be lighting... She, he's, like, stashed the money up the tree, but she's lighting it so she knows where it is. So maybe somebody had to... Yeah. Maybe someone's got some trees around them and they stashed the money. Got a lot of cards here for this, yeah. I'm not going to do them. Right, Taurus, this next line is, is this indifference in love. And it's got something to do with either you going in towards somebody with an apology or somebody coming in towards an apology with you. And somebody's out of uncertainty. Somebody also feels like they need to protect themselves, like they're going to come in, but they're wearing all this armour. Maybe they'll go out towards somebody from the past. Maybe somebody's coming in with a cup of love. Maybe you're about to tell them what for because you're not uncertain about this situation anymore. Or that's somebody else. Yeah, <laughs> you've got three of the, sorry I'm laughing because you've got three of the knights there. You've got one knight, a water sign, coming in with a cup of love. You've got a knight of pentacles leaving with some money. And then you've got the chariot card, he's coming in, that's a cancer coming in maybe, in a chariot. Yeah, and it could have to do with a situation where something's been illuminated about a situation. You could be quite nervous or somebody's up at a night time stressing about that situation as well. What's this uncertainty about? Could be about keeping a Leo's mouth shut or using the strength to open somebody's mouth. Or to shut somebody's mouth, one or two. He looks like he's got very big teeth. And also that... <laughs> yeah, whoever's trying to shut that... 
I'm going to call it a Leo because it's a Leo card. But yeah, shut that mouth up. They've actually got themselves attached to that person. So whoever that person is probably can read them like a book because they're actually attached if you didn't know. Yeah, somebody might, that person might be very single. Might have a little dog. Yeah, somebody's heavily spying online on this situation as well. It could be being watched by authorities or somebody like that. Yeah, could it also involve two, the lovers card. It could be a Gemini, but it also could be a, um, a choice between two lovers. Or a choice was made or somebody did something. They've got a big snake around their leg though. Or at least a man has. Some black man somewhere could have a big snake around their leg. About to bite them. Yeah, somebody's going to get bit by a snake, look. Like, literally. <laughs> right. So what's this ending that's happening? And it could even been with a war sign. Somebody went off to go and get recognition and reward. Fuck up, sort of fuck ups. Yeah, the screams, terrible screams. <laughs> Your magnetism is very powerful. And this person spelled what it was meant for you got a child. Planting seeds in your head and don't sleep with this person because they need an STD test. Yeah, what's this ending about this Ten of Swords? Yeah, that's about somebody putting a spanner in the works on a situation. And it could have something to do with a Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody who's ready to fight right now. Somebody who's also trying to end some cycle or is ending some cycles. And it could have something to do with a Virgo. Or the hermit shines a light in the situation. This hermit ain't shining a light. He's scared now. Uh, terrified with his little red nail varnish on. Yeah. What's this king of... Uh, his king of cups is somebody who's gone away to heal. Maybe that's what the ending's done. Maybe somebody had to heal themselves so they could get recognition and reward in a situation. It could have been someone you are in a commitment with Taurus. But there's you. And you look like you're praying to me with your knees knocking. Let me just change up these cards quickly. So what else is coming to know about this King of Cups? Yeah, someone's, someone's become enlightened to a situation, to something that was going on and just brought down a town. It could have something to do with a new beginning with abundance. It could also involve your friends as well, so they could be involved in this situation. Yeah. Someone's, someone's done a reflection. Somebody could be doing something in a mirror, but someone's had a reflection. They've seen something. It's got something to do with that snake. It could also be to do with Virgo energy. And then we've got Scorpio energy coming in about a transformation that's happened. Maybe a death's happened. That's going to cause a transformation. So it's causing somebody a lot of stress at this time, though. And it could be over a commitment. Or a Gemini with that energy. Right, this next line, Taurus is this love and it could have something to do with a king of air which is gemini libra aquarius where there was some juggling going on where a veil's being brought down at the moment maybe on quite a lot of people because there's a whole village in that situation there's a lot going on yeah Gonna cause a complete end in whatever this situation, this juggling situation, this choices somebody made. Yeah, choices with the seven of cups. Somebody's choices is they were they weren't all that great. Yeah, maybe somebody who's been a player and took action somewhere and it could have had something to do with an Aries or an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. Right, this next line for us is um Choices again, Seven of Cups, and it's got something to do with somebody being single and somebody also getting a new beginning with stability and it could involve a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio, somebody who could be very sensitive but she's actually in a shell at the moment so she's not actually in the water, somebody could have got multiple stab wounds, yeah. Someone's trying to drug you, so you need to be aware, and there's a lot of hidden fuck buddies. Somebody could have been trying to stab somebody. Somebody's going to meet a lot of challenges if they do that, yeah. And it could have something to do with your family or people from your past, your childhood tours. Yeah, where there was a lot of illusions and lies. Maybe somebody's been having dreams about that. Maybe you've been dreaming about what these people wanted to do to you. Or people have been turning up in your dreams. There's something about that at the moment. People turning up in people's dreams. People are doing stuff to turn up in people's dreams. Yeah, you may notice. Right, I'm not going to do them. Let's do this next line. Right, we've got the end of this sneaky behaviour, this theft, this attaching dark stuff to people. It's an end of that. Yeah, and these temptations that are being set. And that could be like people from your past. People tried to really hurt you, like to absolutely gut you. Or you did that to somebody, yeah. 
going to be tests or somebody is being tested. It could be on somebody's luck, but somebody definitely is being tested on their juggling, on what they were up to. A Scorpio could be involved in that and a Pisces Aries cusp. Your ex-ex is involved in this somehow. Secrets are now coming out. Virgo, Moon could be relevant. Leo, Ascendant and Narcissist. These games will have been well and truly played. Change up. Pisces could be relevant. And am I laughing? Yes, I am. <laughs> They've got other people watching you. The veil's being lifted or will be. And Saturn could be relevant. Capricorn and also Gemini Moon. Right. What's this sneaky behaviour been reversed? That's got something to do with your comfort, but you come into some wisdom, it could have been on an Aries, it could have been on a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio, someone you had a commitment with, yeah, someone you may have even celebrated with, but you've had a vision now, Taurus, on that situation. What's this temptation about? Yeah, this temptation's on about you taking back your power and going off on a journey, maybe on your own, maybe you had to leave people behind, maybe you were feeling quite sad in that situation. Yeah, and it could have to, something to do with your integrity as well. Maybe you're just being tested from other bubble on how you, how, you, how you deal with this situation and what you do in this situation, what choices you make in this situation. Yeah, you need to break free maybe from a family situation. Something maybe you've been trying to have a resolution in, trying to sort out, maybe that's not working too well. Yeah, someone caused you heartache, heartache, and you get victory, Taurus, by speaking the truth. Your father could be relevant, or someone's father could be relevant, lower energy. Somebody's on the run, and yeah, somebody can get imprisoned, bitch please, and something burdensome, it's time to release it. Incest could be relevant, Capricorn, Aquarius, cusp could be relevant, and something in traffic's watching you, and it could be a Virgo, Libra cusp. Yeah, evidence is being revealed. Karma for Gemini, that's learning to tell the truth. Uh, take time to breathe out. Your past is returning. Stop ignoring all the red flags. This person's a reptilian. And yeah, that could be an Aries. The fire sign, fatherhood could be relevant. Blood, tours, sweat and tears. And relationship status, air and water. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that's what we just saw. Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio. Yeah, something is your destiny. The Wheel of Fortune is turning. I feel like it's on you. It depends on what you do and how you deal with this. Yeah, and it could have something to do with some, a lot of money. But there's judgment being called. And it could have something to do with somebody's past. Two children could be involved in that. Yeah, and somebody was being very, very generous. And that made somebody have a departure. Or somebody needs to make a departure. But somebody's very uncertain at this time. Yeah, and it's causing a lot of drama. Someone's very determined to do something. It could have something to do with abundance. It could even be a pregnancy, but we did see that earlier. It doesn't have to be a pregnancy. They could just be in a new beginning. Somebody went off in a new beginning with abundance, maybe. Yeah, someone took action in that as well. Could have been spiritual. <coughs> but there was an indifference in love, and somebody now needs to find peace in their life again. Yeah, you're being guided, though, Taurus. Yeah. There's a lot of gossips, there's a lot of people talking about this situation. Some of it's become very burdensome, yeah. And somebody needs to go off and have a new beginning with abundance. And that could even be you, Taurus. There could even be a Leo involved in this situation. Something that somebody put a lot of restrictions up against. And it could even be on a home family situation. Yeah, somebody needs to have new inspiration in this situation, maybe, as well. Oh, I'm bending my cards up. Yeah, you could feel like you need to isolate, or you do need to isolate from the situation, and it could have something to do with a partnership, and it could have something to do with your happiness, or it could have something to do with a Leo. Yeah, somebody needs to make a choice and make pro progress forward. You could have had a prophecy about the situation, about how somebody was controlling something, and it could have had something to do with a devil energy, addictions, but somebody was getting crowned, and somebody didn't like that in the background, they got very jealous. Yeah. Could have involved a Virgo towards Capricorn. Could have involved the father of your children as well. Yeah, something about a blessing. But somebody stole that blessing. Maybe you know about that, Taurus. Yeah, could have even been a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Somebody wanted to take independence. Somebody could have broke free from a situation. Another woman, your sister, a cousin, or a friend could be involved in this. Twelfth has Pisces. That's um, karma, family secrets, hidden enemies, relocation. Confinement, rebirth, sacrifice, surrender, intuitions, collective unconscious, hormone injections, family member, close friend, cousin trying to cause a fatal accident. Somebody's having sex with you to take your money. Telepathy, 
the letter K could be relevant, Scorpio moon, cut or cause meditation, the Pope, somebody religious could be relevant, someone's leaving, walking out the door, evil eye on you, brother or sister working and sleeping with this person at the same time, and Freemasonry could be relevant. Yeah, somebody could have an idea about that as well. Could have been Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody made a decision. I mean, it could have been on, on their success, but it ended all these cycles. Yeah, and somebody was very dedicated to some money. Maybe even doing some magic on that, but it caused them a loss in the end. Yeah, it took a lot of preparation. And maybe they did that to somebody they trusted, or it could have been you. And it could have involved a new beginning with love. But now somebody needs to heal from that, because somebody was pouring love in, one, in two different places. Yeah. And there's been a recognition on that situation. And it could be on a blessing or a higher level of commitment. But there's a definite need for healing. And that could even be with a Leo. Right, Taurus, I'm going to leave it there. I might get you a couple of these. Yeah, you need to relax. Everything's okay. Don't worry. Be happy. Talk about your feelings. Someone's admiring you from afar. Major options on a major scale there. And they've got a gaffer. Yeah, somebody could be being instructed to move in. Some messages you don't want to see are coming in. Same old, same old, you know, and big delays as always. Right, I'm leaving it there. Love and light to us. Take care. Bye-bye.